All right, you guys, welcome back to another What's For Dinner. This recipe should have already been up on my channel, but I have turkey meatballs, gnocchi, and sauce, and then I have an oat flour cheddar bay biscuit to go along with it. I did not film this, but I did leave it in the description box on how to make it. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoy this, and I'll see you guys tomorrow in another What's For Dinner. All right, you guys, I am having my first ever White Castle burger for dinner. I will see you guys tomorrow and another what's for dinner. All right, hey, guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is what's for dinner. Um, I brought one of these up here because my phone died, but this is what everybody else is having along with pot stickers. I'm just going to eat pot stickers because I'm not feeling the best, but I know I have to put food in my stomach. We have a lot going on as a family, so... It's just made my nerves all kinds of crazy. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know what's going on, but I'm not going to post it over here on YouTube. Um, anyways, I have some oven roasted chicken teriyaki bowls in the freezer um, that everybody else is going to heat up, but I'm just going to eat pot stickers, like I said. And then this sauce is soy sauce, sugar, midden. Most of the time I put sesame oil in it, but I didn't this time. And then some red pepper flakes. So that is what this is. And I love to dip it in this. I did my pot stickers in the air fryer. Not my favorite way to cook them. Definitely steam them. But this is what it's for dinner tonight. I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, this is going to be a short what's for dinner. Um, today's Friday. Um, and the last couple of nights we have not cooked. We have just honestly ate whatever we wanted to so I haven't cooked again family a lot of family stuff going on so um we had you guys would have seen it but we've had uh White Castle which I've never had White Castle in my life so we had that this week um other than that I honestly don't know what I filmed what I have filmed what I haven't filmed my head is just in going all kinds of directions and I know I need to take a mental time for myself so if I did film it this week I will edit it and get it up for you guys it'll be in this video if not then it will be it wouldn't be shown so I'm um, sorry that this is going to be short but I will see you guys tomorrow for another what's for dinner all right you guys this should sum up my day this is what's for dinner tonight I will see you guys tomorrow. I am trying to mentally take a mental day. So, because I'm done. This is what's for dinner, and I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, now I'm going to add some salt and pepper. And a little bit of pepper. I hate these little shakers. I need to find one that has like bigger holes or something. Alrighty. Then I'm going to put this in a 9 by 13 pan and put it in the oven as well. Once I cut up the green onions. So that way it will, I want to make them a little bit runnier. That's why I added more milk. Because that way, when they're in the oven staying warm, they're not going to dry out. Quickly do that. I still have lots of cream cheese in here, and I'm just trying to mix it out. Okay. That is pretty amazing.
that way everything everything is ready to go when everybody gets here. And then I'm going to take a little bit of butter chop it up and put it on top as well. I have no knives over here. We'll use this guy. it up on top I'll probably cut up the green onions and put them on top after it comes out of the oven so that way they don't dry the green onions don't dry out all right that's enough butter so I'm gonna foil this and get this in the oven I'm just gonna toss them in right now until the butter melts and then I will put what I need to on top. Okay, so now I'm in a different pot and I'm making gravy. So I put two tablespoons of butter and then I put an entire thing of turkey broth in here. Then I added some poultry seasoning, garlic powder, onion powder, pepper and then I'm going to use these since we're not making homemade gravy like from the turkey drippings which is what we normally do this is killing me right now with my dad smoking the turkey uh but because you don't make gravy for turkey with packages it's not a thing but I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna make it taste as good as I possibly can. Cause nothing beats homemade gravy from the drippings of a turkey. So that is what I'm doing right now, is just making the gravy. And then I'm gonna put it, pour it in my Pyrex dish, and then put it in the microwave just so that way it's not sitting on the counter. Um, and then I'll just microwave it to warmth once everybody gets here. So that way I'm not stressing about trying to get everything done. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I'll see you guys when we make chimichangas. Turkey, mashed potatoes, creamy casserole, gravy. What is for dinner? 